see. All right, so how many seats again? Oh gosh, bye. Eight seats total. Yeah, eight seats total is what we need. I think that I want to put at least two in the dining room to make this worthwhile because we don't want to have a lovely dining table with no seating. We want the, the, all the Sims to kind of interact with each other. So yeah, I think I'll make that decision. But if anybody else has any other seating that they want me to add, please leave it there in the chat for me. Let me know what you want. These are so cute, but they don't match. Okay, we will go with this one. Yeah, that matches. So we'll put two. They can sit right next to each other there. So there's two more chairs. So guys, we have two in the love seat and two over here. So that's four. We're halfway done with our seating allowed for this. Oh, uh, okay, Amanda. Yeah, I don't have a schedule yet. So maybe one of these days I'll be able to get a schedule and then I won't have overlapping issues. But yeah, <laughs> can't have a schedule yet because uh, it's just so crazy around my house all the time. Let me see, where else should I put stuff? I don't want any more in the kitchen. I don't know. Should we have something up here so they can sit and read? No, they'll sit on the beds, won't they? But the beds are gonna be occupied. I should probably put at least one up in a room somewhere. So, let's see, there's this room that has a bookshelf and that room has a bookshelf. I think a chair would look mighty lovely right here. We're gonna just plug one in. One of, which one? Something inviting. This looks like it belongs, kind of. There we go. We'll just put that one there. That doesn't look half bad. Two more, I think, right? We have one, two, three, four, five. We have three more, eight. Armchair, do you want me to put another armchair up there? Or should I put one down here in the TV room? Because I could put one down here, and that would probably look pretty nice. That would probably look really good. Just like, put one right here. Yay, nay. I think that would look nice. Then they could have more than one person over here. More than a couple people here. So there we go. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Two more. Two more seating, my friends. Two more. Any preference of what I should do? Should I put another set of two here or should I put another one in the living room I do too I love the music that comes with that's actually in game music um, I don't have any music running on the stream um, that's the music that came with the vampires game pack and uh, that's my favorite you hear it in the build mode and I think you hear that when you go into the um, like the world screen, you hear that music too, and I think it's in cast. I love that music, it's my favorite. You're off, okay, Christina C. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you for the wave raid, I really appreciate that. And the bits and everything, I, I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for being here. All right, so let's see, what did you say? Maybe outside or the dining table. So maybe I should put, maybe I will use this as another seating spot. So we can use this one and I'll put two chairs out here. That will work for me. That way they, it's a dining table and it's outside. Kill two birds with one stone. There we go. I hope they can get to these though. <gasps> this seems to be snapping funny. Do these not snap to that? Oh, it won't because it's a living chair. Ha <laughs> derp by. Yeah, thank you so much, Christina C. That was really nice of you. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your evening. Let's see, here we go. Yeah, see, these will do it. Ah, there we go. Oops, I just lagged. There we go, because they, were, they weren't gonna work. So I'm just gonna double check because I remember making this mistake and thinking that I, I had too many or not enough seating and I totally bombed. So we have one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and I put one up here. So that makes eight, and we can have seating for eight. We have six bed spots, one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's good. And let's see, only one piece of nappable furniture, including beds. I didn't see that, but actually that's impossible. 
Sims can actually take naps in bathtubs and in any of these chairs. So I think that that maybe that part of the rules is no longer a thing. We have two sinks, one and two. Two sinks, two toilets. There's one there. There's one there and two shower tubs. Perfect. I can have a TV and a computer at the same time and I have both of those. Perfect, so now we just need to come up with five skill building items, folks. Let's see. You should totally stream. It is so much fun. It is a total game changer for me. I'm having a blast with it. It's absolutely amazing. Being able to talk and have actual adult conversations and interactions with viewers right off the bat, and it's just it's so much fun. Don't be nervous. It is so much fun. You are going to love it. You're going to get back into it once you moved in. Awesome, Bethany. I can't wait because I have only gone to like, I think I've only been able to make one or two of your streams, but I know I had so much fun when I was there. So I can't wait for you to get back into it too. I want to see more Drifter Challenge. Yeah, that'll be exciting. It won't be long before you're all moved in. Let's see. I should find out which aspiration or aspirations should I work on. I really should have done the research, guys. Let's see. I'm going to go into live mode for a second. And I want to see all the different aspiration choices because before I choose my five skill building items, because if I am under the correct impression, once you choose whatever you choose, you're locked into it, folks. So I can't change. So I can't get an easel if I decide to do anything with the painting. I can't get an easel once I start if I didn't do it. Yes, Drifter. That's right, Drifter. Yes. <laughs> I want to see it. I want you to get back in Drifter. I'm pro Drifter. Okay, so here we go. This is my sim. Right now, I have the Outdoor Enthusiast Aspiration. Now, this one, I don't even think I can do because I don't think you can go on vacation. Could be wrong, but I don't think you can go on vacation, so I'm going to have to change that anyways. So we have a lot of different aspirations, my friends. We have a lot. And I have no idea how in the world I'm going to choose one at all. Like, I have no idea. There's so many. I don't know. Is there any of these that are, like, off limits? Let's see. Maybe you can do Outdoor Enthusiast. It says the Outdoor enthusiastic, enthusiastic, Enthusiast Aspiration is allowed. You can travel to Granite Falls when you need to complete certain goals in the Outdoor Enthusiast. When traveling, you must bring all of your fellow patients and choose the campground as your destination. Oh my gosh, that would be an absolute nightmare. I choose not to do outdoor enthusiast. <laughs> that would be horrible, guys. We're not going to do that one. Nope. Let's see. What else? Everyone in the asylum is allowed a job, but they have to be in the criminal career field. Okay. So, we need five skill building items. I have to pick my first aspiration. So, what is your guys' favorite aspiration in game? Or, what is an aspiration that you haven't seen done yet that you want to see? There's also one that is not going to be listed on here, and it is the grilled cheese aspiration. And that one is triggered by in-game eating of grilled cheese. So, that's also a possibility, because it doesn't have anything else on here. It says they're pretty much all open grounds. I, actually, that's a lie. That's a lie. There is some that you can't do right? There has to be. I thought I saw something about certain ones you can't do, but I don't know. So, okay, there are some we can't do, guys. No successful lineage, no big happy family, no fabulously wealthy mansion baron or soulmate. Aside from that, they're all fair game. Is there anyone that you haven't seen that you would like to see or that is your favorite that you'd like to see me tackle? This might be fun. A chef one? Let's see. This one we have to do parties. The grilled cheese would be fun. I really want to try that one. So maybe I should just straight up go for that one. What do you think? That would be fun. I don't think a lot of people have seen the grilled cheese aspiration, to be honest. I have to complete two on my sim here. She On, on Sierra, she has to complete two uh, aspirations before she's free. Grilled cheese would be fun. And so I think maybe we'll try with that one. We'll try to trigger that. So I can have um, five skill building items. So I'm going to have to go back into the build mode, actually. <laughs> We're going to have to figure this out. 
Okay, you want me to go for grilled cheese? Sounds like a plan. We're gonna we're gonna try our hand at unlocking that grilled cheese aspiration and going for it. Um, I did a little tutorial when the grilled cheese aspiration first came out, and the only thing I know about the grilled cheese aspiration, folks, is how to trigger it. I don't know anything about it, so that'll be fun for me because I've never done it, and uh, yeah, so that would be fun. So let's see, what do we have for skill building items? I think it would be probably fun, maybe to have some like a punching bag or something that they can do like this. Actually, you know what, like chess and stuff is also good because it gets your residents playing together. So gosh guys, what do I do? Let's see, we can have music. There's a bar for bartending, but that's gonna cost us money. So probably nothing that costs money. Photography is a skill. I wonder if that kind of counts as something we can do. Hmm. But they're gonna put that in their inventory, aren't they? They are going to put that in their inventory. Okay, so let's see. We could get a basketball hoop. That might be kind of fun. What do you guys think about a basketball hoop? There's room out here for one. Yeah, maybe we should do that. Or there's a slip and slide. This one's fitness and motor skill. Okay, which one, guys? You tell me which one should we do. Should we do a water slide? Because I haven't messed with the water slide very much. Or should we get a basketball hoop? Both of them do fitness. So this one's a fun of five and it gives fitness and motor. And this one is just fitness, but I believe it does have fun mixed into it. Oh, <gasps> grilled cheese aspiration requires me having and building a rocket. That might be cool though. So I'd have to buy the rocket right now because that would be rocket science skill. <gasps> Perfect though. That would be good, right? We should do that. That's something we should do. So you guys tell me which one of these you you think I should do, but I am definitely gonna get a rocket and we're gonna do rocket science skill. That would be great. Let's see, what is that one listed under? Oh lordy, I should just type in rocket. I don't know what it's listed under. There it is, the rocket. See, rocket science skill, and it actually gives you fun. So we're gonna do that. Good job, thank you Lori for telling me. You just saved everything because that would be horrible if I chose it and then we couldn't do anything with it. <laughs> That'd be horrible. Good catch, good catch. All right, so there's our first skill building item. Four more, which one? You want the water slide, Nikki? Sounds like a plan. I haven't used the water slide. Um, I used it when I did my first impressions, when I went through and did that. Um, that's the only time I've actually used it, never purchased it, because as a drifter, many of you guys know who play the drifter challenge, um, it's one of those things that's kind of a after the fact fun foofy thing and we always have to be responsible. We have to adult so we can never choose the fun stuff. So I've never played with this to be honest. Just in that time is the only time I played with it. What are our choices? There's fish and frogs and I think there's one more. Circles. I kind of like the fish. We should go with the fish. So we're gonna we're gonna pop it in. Let's see they're gonna go they're gonna run this way right? Which way are they going to come off of it? You have to eat grilled cheese in space. Oh, you do? Okay. Awesome. I've never done that before. Never, never, never. I don't know which way they come off of it. I think they run up on it this way, right? Gosh, guys, I don't know. We'll find out. If I botch this, then I'll just have to turn it around. I'm assuming this is like the starter spot and they go this way. But I really don't know. Okay, so that's skill building item number two. So we have three more left to go. Are there any suggestions for what you would like? Uh, with the grilled cheese aspiration, she has to make grilled cheese, of course. She already has her stove and that doesn't count as a skill building item. So I don't have to worry about any food making skills. So what else do we have for skill building items? We've got, and right now we have rocket science and we have um, fitness. So we have, there's music stuff we could do, I don't think the cameras are going to be a good option. There is, well, we could do the painting. That might be nice to have um, an easel. They can make us money then if they just autonomously do it. I don't know how apt they are to autonomously paint, but if they did, then that would give the asylum money to pay the bills and stuff, which might be handy. What do you guys think about an easel? Do you think that's a good idea? Is that smart? And should I get a chess table? kind of want to spread out my ideas of different uh, skills because I have no idea what I'll do next. So I don't know, but I think an easel would be good here. 
So I'm gonna plonk one down, and if you if you think that's a bad idea, you need to tell me no. <laughs> tell Vi no. There we go, I'm gonna put that down. If you want to do the space career afterwards, you need logic right. Um, actually, I don't know. The only space career I have worked on is uh, the one where you go into um, the science career field, the scientist. Chess table? Yeah, I think I will do a chess table. And I'm actually going to put the chess table back up here. <laughs> Funnily enough, this is where they had it originally and I deleted it. I will put the chess table. And the chairs that go with the chess table don't count, so we are going to be good in that department. So I'm going to put this back up here. The easel is good too. Okay, awesome. So we've got this, and I'm going to put some chairs. Comfort. Get a couple chairs up here. And we're just going to go with some basic something or another. I don't like those though. But these give me comfort, and these don't. So I guess I'm going to have to go with the no comforts. Alright, so we're going to put... Oh, can't intersect object. Did I mess this up? Why not? I did mess it up. Hold on. Hold on. It goes this way? No, it doesn't. Why didn't they not work? There we go. Okay. I don't know why it wasn't working. There we go. Now we got it. We got the chest table. So that's one. We have easel, which is two. Water slide, which is three. And rocket science. Well, we need one more skill building item, folks. So we've got painting. Rocket, logic, and fitness. What else really is there that's fun? What else do we have? Let's see, we can give massages. That gives the wellness skill, but that's kind of along the same lines as the fitness, so I don't know if that would be redundant. We could do music, so I could put the piano back. There used to be a piano here, so if we want to do music stuff, I could put the piano or any of the other stuff here. They have this one. The pipe organ skill, that's something new. Uh, this came with the vampire expansion. Ooh, my dog. He's trying to be an attack dog. I have a very small dog, and my kids have all been outside playing. And uh, my daughter just came in, and my dog's just like, Rawr, and he's just this little tiny little thing. He thinks he's a big dog. <laughs> so I don't know about you guys, but I think that the organ might be fun to put in there because this uh, gives you fun, and it's the pipe organ skill. And this is something that maybe potentially multiple sims can use as well. I'm really trying to think of what everybody would kind of get into. So unless this is a no-no, I'm going to plonk it down. Let me know if you are upset with this. <laughs> Let me know if you don't like this idea, guys. Gosh, it will stop pivoting. Come here. There we go. What colors do we have? <gasps> Gosh darn it. Why does it do that? Let's see. There we go. That's going to match the decor in here. So let's put it back. Guys, I'm having issues with this. Okay, there we go. And you know what? That frames it pretty nice. It looks pretty fly. I kind of like it. So that's all of our skill building. So we have... We have the... Uh, let me see. Oh my goodness, guys. I'm so sorry about the dogs. Like I, My dog, I'm sorry. Like I said, my kids are just now coming in. So my dog's going crazy. Come here. Under your bed. Come here. You're being disrupted, dog. Get in there. There we go. All right. Hopefully he will behave himself now. All right. So as far as I know, guys, I have everything that I need. Um, I need to drop the funds down to a thousand because a thousand is what it says on there. So we need money. One thousand. That didn't work. Okay. So... <coughs> oh, my goodness. Holy moly. Dog, are you okay? <laughs> he tried to run and my my chair rolled over his tail, I think. He's got long hair on his tail. You have a small dog too and she barks at everyone? I know, right? Any any tiny little sound and he just like barks about it. Let's see. Cheats are enabled, so we'll try that again. Money, 1,000. There we go. Now all our money's gone. We're down 1,000. We're gonna start the grilled cheese aspiration and I think that's everything that needs to happen. I can get them all a job. Maybe I should do that. We're supposed to get them jobs in the criminal career field is the only one that they're allowed to have. So I don't know, is it smart to get them all jobs or should they all stay at home? They're gonna break everything. Let's see, I'm gonna go ahead and we'll start here with join a career. Hi Deborah. welcome to the stream. How's it going today? Doesn't he look fab? I love it. Hagrid is freaking awesome. 
Okay, he's joining his career. I'm gonna just go down the line. I'm gonna let them all kind of run in there. And he can get the criminal. There we go. So there's, there's sim number one. I'm gonna skip mine because it doesn't have any restrictions on what she can do. So let's get them. I gave my sims a cow plant at the asylum for giggles. Oh yeah, did you, did you use the buy debug cheat and get one? Or did you, um, did you fish one out? That would be kind of funny. Okay, where are you? There you are. <gasps> okay, hey. thank you so much for my my host there, Nikki. I appreciate that. Rachie B, you're getting ready for bed. Okay, thank you so much for coming out and everything. I enjoyed having you here. Thank you so much. I I love your sim here. So we have your sim. It's exciting. But you have a very good night. Thank you for stopping by. Let's see. Uh, criminal, that's right. Criminal for you. And Blair, we gotta get her in the criminal field. Look at this, they're all going out here to play. And it's turned the way I wanted it, fabulous. I was hoping that's the way that it would be. Look at them all having fun, I'm excited. Criminal, bam. And our next one, Alania, or Alani, it's Alani. They fished it up and thought, why not? Yeah, heck yeah, thought it would be fun. Did it eat any of your Sims? It probably ate them, but it didn't kill them, I'm assuming. Oh my goodness, Rachie. Thank you so much for those bits. That's amazing. Awesome. Oh, and they're purple. That's fun. Yay. A hundred bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's see, criminal for this one. Oh my gosh, I'm trying to stay on target. Stay on track, by Join a career. I really, really, really appreciate those bits. It's something new for me because I just got Twitch affiliate this afternoon. So I'm not even used to that little tinkled noise. I was like, what is that? Criminal. And join a career. Thank you, Rachel. Have a good night. Let's see. Uh, he's joining. Let's go over here where all the action is happening. They're all having fun. Join that career, buddy. Come on. Let's do it. Let's get you in the career field. Constantly they got eaten, but nobody died. That's too bad. So they heeded the whole warning of, oh no, she's embarrassed. So they didn't, nobody died from it. So they only got eaten once at a time. Let's see, we have an embarrassed Sim. Rachie B, she's embarrassed because she had a trick trictastrophe from the water slide. Oh no, was anyone watching? That trick went spectacularly wrong and I missed it. Do you lose if someone dies? Um, if somebody dies, you don't die. You don't lose. Hold on, let me, uh, let's see. This, the rules that I have, um, I am playing on the easy mode. If a sim dies, nothing happens. On medium mode, if a sim dies, one of the seats must be deleted. So you can still keep going and it's not like against the rules and it's not like a house fail or whatever. You can keep playing. And for me, because I'm on easy mode, nothing happens if my Sims die. But of course, then they're not going to be making money anymore for me, which is not good because uh, we need money to pay for the bills and stuff. And I probably did a bad thing because I left the house the way that it is with all the goodies inside. And we're going to have to pay bills on that. We only have a thousand. So it was probably not smart, but Nobody said that I would be smart playing this game. Let's see. I need to get her a job, and I have no idea what career. Actually, we should put her in... Hmm. We were thinking rocket stuff because of the grilled cheese aspiration. So maybe it would be smart for us to throw her in the astronaut career field. Yeah. Maybe we should do that. I'm going to do that because that's going to give her rocket science skill. Maybe. I don't know. Because that wasn't added with... um they get to work. So maybe that doesn't give me rocket science skill, but, 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 maybe that would be useful. Is that smart? As the smart guys, let me know. Should I do this? Astronaut? That would give me access to the things. I don't know. Should I do astronaut career field? What do we do? We get 26 an hour and she works from eight to five. Let me see what time these criminals go. They work from five to 12. So, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. I'm going to go ahead. I don't see anybody saying, no, Vi, don't stop. So I'm going to pop her into the astronaut career field. So now I believe every single one of my Sims that are here, they all have 
a job. So I'm going to go ahead and cancel all this stuff up here. Yes. So let's see. We need to get started on that ASAP. So while her stats and everything are still good, I'm going to have her come over here. Don't go outside just a minute. We got to cook. And I don't know, is that a first one? It is a first one. We're going to do a party size because she has to eat like she has to hoover this to get this aspiration to pop up. So come back here. What are you doing? She's running all the way over here. You're in the way, sir, sir. Dylan can now discuss workout techniques. So they're all learning. They're going to get skinny. Hagrid is going to lose weight. I don't know if I like that. I kind of like him being all cute because they're going to lose weight. <laughs> when, when their athletic skill goes up, I think that their body mass goes down. I could be wrong, but I think that's what happens. There we go. Cook up that grilled cheese. I hope you do not start a fire because that would be terrible. And I cannot wait until like a day goes by here at the asylum because that's when things are going to get crazy because their sims are going to get dirty and they're going to be fighting for bathrooms and stuff's going to be breaking. We have the welcome wagon. Oh, who showed up this time? Let's go find out. Who, who came over here? We have, we have Vivian Lewis and we have, who are you? You're the older one. Dennis Kim and Eric Lewis. Um, I usually don't like having um, people over, but let's just invite them in. We should not be rude. We should let them come in and break our stuff. Oh, look at these lovely ladies. Are they sitting here chatting? Chrissy is chatting with Rachie. Well, maybe not. She's playing on her phone. Oh, well, you know, that's okay. All right, come over here. Are you watching your food? Are you watching your food, Sierra? You're going to make a fire. You guys can hear the in-game sounds, okay? Just want to know. Make sure everything sounds all right. Okay. I'm going to speed him up. So I'm actually not going to say hi to Vivian. I want, to get, I want her to get this grilled cheese aspiration started, at least. I want to get this started. Ready? This is taking forever. Come on. All right. Nobody else eat these. I need to eat like three plates so in a row. <gasps> oh my. Meal. These two are not getting along Fresh at all. Yeah. She just got yelled Fresh at. Alani just gave her a piece of her mind. <laughs> oh my. Oh, Hurry up and eat that and then have another one. And I think it is three in a row. If I'm not mistaken, it's been a long time since I tried that. But I believe it was three in a row and it will spark the grilled cheese aspiration. Bye bye, Vivian. Gosh, guys, they're really not getting along. What is this now? She has an aggravating conversation. Feeling angry after an unpleasant conversation. Provoke. Guys, stop being mean to each other. Stop it. Stop it. Eat that grilled cheese. It's going really slow. My, my speed three does not really work very well, apparently. You guys need to stop being mean. She wants to provoke her again? Gosh, guys, they're going to be enemies. That's terrible. That's terrible. I'm sorry, whatever we did. It's because we both have black hair. I knew it. She's upset. Oh, she is upset because she doesn't have a cappuccino maker. Hmm. Let's see. Let's go a little bit faster. It's an offensive conversation, and she's really upset. All right, put that plate down. You need to grab another one. Let's get this grilled cheese going. Let's get this going. Oh, oh, look at her stomping around. She's going to come in here. i got to see what everyone else is up to. Are you going to take it all the way in here? She's going to take it all the way in here. <laughs> She's not even going to sit at any of the tables. Oh, well, that passed for her. Why? Nicely decorated? Okay. It's because I didn't take away any of the stuff. Oh, that sim is so cute over here. Guys, everybody's sims look so good. Thank you so much for letting me use them. All right, I'm going to speed time up again just because I want to get this aspiration at least started before anything else happens. Her fun is going down, even though she's talking to people. It's going down. Keep going. Keep going. Is anyone else having troubles with their speed three, not really speed three-ing? It's kind of annoying. Okay, go grab the last one. 
See, now it's going and it won't stop. It went like speedy quick forever. What are you doing? You're just having fun, Blair. Anybody else outside still? Or did they all come inside? Let's find out. Oh, I'm turned around. Okay, we still have people out here. We have... Oh, you came out here to cool off. You're coming out here to cool off. The game keeps freezing for me. It's lagging a lot on your end. Okay, guys. Well, um, as soon as I get the grilled cheese aspirations uh, started, I'm going to be ending stream. I think that when I stream for too long at a time, it starts lagging for people. And I don't know if it's just because there's like a lot of um, traffic right now. Because right now here, it's almost 7 o'clock. And so there's probably a lot of people online. So I'm going to go ahead and get this aspiration started. And then I'm going to go ahead and, and end stream. So I'm sorry it's laggy. That kind of stinks. Kind of puts a damper on things, you know? Uh-huh. Acquired the comedy skill. <laughs> what? Uh -huh. Okay, here we go, guys. Um, Sierra has unlocked the hidden grilled cheese aspiration. It can be found with the other food aspirations. So we are going to pick that one up right there. Grilled cheese aspiration. 